When we follow Jesus, the Holy Spirit, who is God, comes to live inside us and he makes us more like Jesus. In God's true book, we're told that he does this in nine ways. And this is the eighth way the Holy Spirit makes us more like Jesus. He makes us more gentle. This is the eighth fruit of the Spirit, gentleness. Sometimes we might think about gentleness as being weak, but you couldn't be more wrong. Gentleness is only possible for people who are strong. If you are a strong person, what can you do with your strength? You can lift heavy things, throw things really far. You can choose to hurt people, but you can also help them. And that is where gentleness comes in. It is using our power for good and kind things. You've probably realised by now that all the fruits of the Spirit need other people to grow. The Spirit makes us more loving, joyful and peaceful as we spend time around other people. Gentleness will mean that we don't just spend time with people like us, people who are strong and able to do stuff. Jesus loves it when we spend time with people who are not like us. Maybe people who are seen as weak or lonely. Being gentle means using our power in loving ways. So I wonder if you can think of anyone who needs some gentleness today. What about someone who is younger than you and not as strong, like a little brother or sister? Maybe if we see parents that are sad, we can be gentle with them. What about people at our schools who aren't as popular? I'm sure you can think of a few examples today of people that we can be gentle with. Now, always remember, if you choose to use your power to hurt people, even though God is gentle, he could do the same to you. God's true book says that he disciplines those that he loves. Like any good parent, sometimes God will allow us to go through hard times to make us more like him. Times where we feel sad or lonely. But always remember, even in hard times, God will be working for our good. He wants what is best for us and he is gentle with us, making us more and more like him. That is the eighth fruit of the Spirit, gentleness.